Hey y'all, it's Danielle. It is... Sorry, class just got out. Uh, well, other kids, I've been done for a while. Um, it's Wednesday? Wednesday the 26th of August. <laughs> And um, coming in with you guys, hopefully going to make this more of a pattern here. Yeah, you dumb bitch, you should have waited. Sorry guys. Um, obviously I'm driving home now and young college kids drive like maniacs up and around here. Um, yeah, I'm going home, whatever. So I came to you guys last week or a couple of days, I, I don't know. But, and I was like, hmm, need to get better at it. School's in session. So, Monday, Wednesday, I have jogging. And Monday, Wednesday, class has been cut short. Uh, the instructor had to have surgery on her foot, so she had to miss Monday. And she's actually going to miss next Monday. And today was just inside the building doing her lecture and her spill and stuff. So, today was cut short again. I still got out there and did a... Uh, one and a half miles today. I did two on Monday. So I am still getting in my fitness. Uh, I'm slowly working back up to it. I started at C to 5K again. Um, so we'll see how that goes. I have honestly got to say, I've been trying to be really good about uh, my diet again and my food choices. But I have discovered I can have ice cream even uh, if you're following, you know I had to cut out dairy for Annabelle. I have discovered I can have ice cream again. Uh, yay for me. Mm, for me as well because I love sugar. So I'm trying to limit my ice cream to once a week. Uh, I know you're going to say, why don't you just cut it out of the way? I can't. I love ice cream so much. And there's ice cream places all around here because it's hotter than a mother. Um, however, Keith and I will not be buying ice cream again. It will not be coming into the house on the regular. Um, so we have to go out for ice cream. Um, I have discovered, I think ice cream's the only thing. Oh, I can have some creamers, which I, Keith had mentioned to it before when I first went dairy free that flavored creamers weren't real creamer and they're not. Um, looking at their ingredients, it says non-dairy ingredients. Uh, and I've tried it and it doesn't make Annabelle sick. I did try cow's milk again. Um, well, I can have goat cheese. I've had goat cheese and it's delicious. I haven't tried feta yet. I think feta's goat cheese. I don't know. Um, but I've had goat cheese and she did fine with that. I've had cheddar cheese. She did not do okay with that. Had a caramel macchiato. She did not do good with that. So no dairy in the liquid form, no dairy in cheese form yet for me. Dairy in ice cream form, good to go. Um, but not the best choices. So yeah, um, I got in on the scale. Lost 0.2 pounds. Woo. Uh, I have been trying to be really good, choosing healthier options. Um, and I only lost 0.2. I know it's going to take a while for what I'm doing now to show up on the scale. It's just so disappointing seeing that. Uh, but we will see, hopefully, with school activity getting uh, back up there again, that I will be able to do what I want to do and stick with my plan. And whenever I'm working out, I want to make better choices because I'm like, why did I just work out if I'm going to eat crap? Um, so we will see you guys, but I just want to come to you and be accountable and put out a little video. Sorry it's scatterbrained. I haven't recorded a video while driving in a long time. Um, so yeah, we will see how it goes, guys. I will talk to y'all later.